Hey guys, this is Karima from Idle Doodle. So in this video, I am going to show you three super easy ways of how to achieve those beautiful Pinterest watercolor backgrounds. These backgrounds can be used in making mandalas, hand lettering quotes or making bookmarks even uh, for the front page of your project. So let's get started onto the video. The first step is to mask your sheet on the table you're working on so that the paper does not crumble. Now here I'm using uh, the Camelin Artist watercolor cakes. To be honest, you can use any color. First of all, wet the paper with plain water. Now here I am going to use three colors for this background which will be scarlet, red, orange, yellow as you can see. Now I am going to take table salt and sprinkle it all over the paper. What salt does is that it soaks the excess water on the sheet and gives a really cool effect. You can do this with rice as well but I like the effect of salt more. So I use salt. Let this dry for the time being. Moving on to the next background, take a tissue paper and crumble it. Dip that tissue paper in a liquid of any color you want as you can see in the plate and, that, and then dab it on the paper. Now play with the texture how dark light you want it to be. To be honest it turns out every time a different pattern. On to the last one, wet the paper as done in the first one. Take a transparent cellophane paper and um, I am going to here use Agile brush pens. I'm going to use the color pink, orange and blue. Place the transparent paper just like I'm showing in the video. This background is really good for writing quotes. And voila, this is how everything turned out to be. And some of the artworks that I did on this beautiful background. I hope this video was useful for you in any means. If it was, make sure to comment down below and tag me on Instagram if you recreate any of these backgrounds. Subscribe to this channel, like this video. Till then. Take care everyone.